Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Fish in Florida. So today is going to be a little bit of a different style video. I don't have too much time to fish. I have about an hour, so I'm not going to take too much b-roll. I'm just going to try to get on some fish. And hopefully we can make that happen. But yeah, I'm actually using a new reel. My birthday is actually coming up really soon. It's on May 16th. So I got this new Shimano SLX. And today I'm just going to be testing it out and fishing with it. I'll probably do a review on this sometime but we'll get to that. All right, let's try my first real cast with this. Jeez, that went way farther than I expected. Oh my gosh, I have one. I got one. Oh my gosh, on my first real cast with this. That was insane. All right, that was crazy. Little bass on the Senko. Wow, guys, that was insane. I took one cast with it. That was actually a really far cast. I wasn't expecting that. It was really controlled too. I didn't have any line to it, anything. But there we go, first bass on my new Shimano SLX. Little guy, see bud? Well, I was not expecting that. I'm using a Senko with text rig hook and a bullet weight. I actually have one bullet weight left, so hopefully I don't snap off. But yeah, guys, today's goal is just to get on some fish. All right, let me talk a little about this reel. As I said, I think I said this already, but I just had another bite. That's crazy. But yeah, I think I've said this already. Um, my birthday's coming up, it's May 16th. But yeah, I got this Shimano SLX. I got the six three to one gear ratio. And so far, I only took like five casts with this, but it feels really nice. Jeez, that cast far. That cast really far. It's super smooth too. So I have, let me show you guys the braking. Really nice how that just pops out, but I have three brakes on and three brakes off. I had no new line left, so I just grabbed some line off of my old Black Max. But yeah, this line's probably like a year to two years old. Really old line. Here's another fish. Got him. Guys, this reel is so smooth. Boom, another bass. That's a little bit of a better fish, still pretty small. Hopefully I can test this on a bigger fish today. All right, yeah guys, this reel is crazy smooth. Casts are really good. Um, I'm gonna talk more about this later though. I'll probably do a review on this. Right now I'm just gonna start focusing and hopefully get on some more and bigger fish. So yeah, let's get to it. I think I see a fish, yeah, that's a fish. Yeah, there's a bunch of fish. Guys, there's a school of bass over here. Oh my gosh, got him. That was sick. Oh no, he popped off. Guys, there was a school of like four bass right there. All right, let's get back out there. I still, yeah, they're right here. They're right here. He ate that on top water. I was reeling that straight in. Well, I don't see where they went, but basically what happened there was I saw a school of four or five bass just cruising down this bank. And I think I see them again. I cast it at them just like that. I was bringing it on top of the water and then one of them just came out and crushed it. Guys, they're blowing up over here. That is insane. Oh, no, I had him. Oh, I went right over him. There's like three fish right here. There he is. Got him. Oh my gosh. Did you guys see that run? Here we go. Third bass of the day. Third bass that I've landed. That's another healthy fish. That's a chunk. See, bud? Here's one. Got him. Guys, I think that's the fourth bass of the day. Another one just reeling it along the bank. They're really shallow. They're right up against the bank. See, bud? All right, guys. I think I've caught four fish so far on this Shimano SLX. Biggest thing I'm noticing so far is how smooth it is. I get it's crazy smooth. The casting is actually really good. Here's a fish. 
Here we go. That was sick. All right, fifth fish of the day. Relax. Oh, I got him in the eye. All right, sorry, bud. I got him in the eye. See you. Well, there goes the fifth fish I've caught on the SLX. But yeah, as I was saying, the casting's actually really good. The spool's really controlled. I'm not getting any backlashes. So yeah. There's one. Got him. Another little guy. Wow, he crushed it though. Jeez, I thought that was a big one. He just took off with it. That was insane. Another little guy, but I'm not complaining. Another bass on the Senko. I'm getting on a lot, guys. All right, guys, I'm switching up spots. So, see you guys at the next spot. All right, guys, made it to the next spot. I have like five minutes left. So hopefully I can get on some really quick fish. And then I gotta run out of here. There's one. Got him. Yes, guys, finally another bass. Boom. It's a little guy, but I'll take it. I was struggling there for a second. I went for a long period with no bites. I think the bite kind of slowed down for some reason. The wind picked up. And yeah, finally got another little guy on the Senko. See, bud? There's one. That's a good fish, I think. What is that? Oh, it's a nice bass. There we go, that's a better fish. Boom, it's actually a good fish. He is fat. Oh yeah, that is a really nice fish. There we go, guys, that's a good fish. Probably around a two pounder, that's a really thick fish. Look at that, nice bass. Another one for the SOX, that was sick. See, bud? There's one. Got him. Yes, guys, another good one. Another better fish. Boom. There we go. Another bass. Crush the Senko. See, bud? All right, guys, I'm heading back. Most likely not going to catch anything else, but I'm going to keep casting, and maybe I'll be able to get one more fish. But that's pretty much going to do it for the video. Again, sorry for the different style video. I only had an hour, so I just wanted to catch fish. Um, I couldn't take any B-roll. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you next time in the next episode of Fishing For It.